Hi, in this section of the course, we're going to look at two really important things, closures and decorators. But first, we'll start with scopes. So we'll look at variable scopes and we'll look at things called the local scope. We'll look at the global scope. We'll also look at something called the non-local scope. And then we'll consider the fact that scopes can be nested. And so we'll discuss what scopes are and how they work in Python. Then we'll look at closures and what they are. And as a hint, they're not equivalent to lambda expressions. Very often closures and lambda expressions are studied together. And so you may think that, well, they're the same thing. They're not. They're actually totally different. And this is why we actually studied lambdas first. And now only are we going to look at closures. Then we'll also look at closure scopes, which is something that's really important and is an integral part of closures. Then we'll look at decorators. We'll look at what are decorators. We'll see how they're related to closures. And then we'll also look at the convenience uh, at sign that you can use, the at symbol in Python for applying decorators and how all that's used. But you actually don't have to use that symbol. It's just a convenience feature that Python provides and we'll see how to do it without. And then we'll look at quite a few applications of closures and decorators. All right, so this should be an interesting section. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.